Getting plastic surgery seems to be a rite of passage in Hollywood, and tons of your favorite celebrities have most likely modified their face in some way, either with filler and Botox or by going under the knife. And in today's list, we will be breaking down the celebrities who got plastic surgery and it ruined their careers. And at number 10, Heidi Montag. The Hill star is famous for going overboard with plastic surgery. She infamously turned her girl next door look into that of a Barbie doll. She even underwent a whopping 10 procedures in one day in 2010, getting neck liposuction, a mini brow lift, a nose job revision, a chin reduction, her ears pinned back, a second breast augmentation, and getting lipo on multiple parts of her body. But shortly after making her breasts a size F, she regretted the change and changed them back to a C in 2014. When speaking about her implants, she said, quote, I couldn't conceptualize the weight of them in my body. They felt like bowling balls on my chest. She then explained that at one point the implants got so heavy, they were starting to fall down. She added, quote, I got scared. It's super dangerous. They can fall through to your belly button. She also told Paper Meg in 2018 that she almost died because of all the surgery. While in the hospital for the aftercare, her heart stopped for a minute and it didn't look like she would make it. And at number nine, Scott Carrot Top Thompson. Carrot Top is no stranger to worst celebrity plastic surgery lists, and his appearance has changed considerably over the years. One doctor told MakeMeHeal.com that it appears as though Thompson has undergone an eyebrow lift, along with Botox injections, lip plumping, and laser peels, which is proved by his disappearing freckles. It's also been speculated that he's taken steroids and they're responsible for his buff appearance, but he denies getting anything done. When speaking about it in 2015, he told Florida Today, quote, I never had any plastic surgery. I can see why people would think that since I got really big for a while, but never had any work done. I mean, if I was going to have plastic surgery, I would look better than this. Since his changing appearance, his confidence and the public's interest in his comedy went way down. And he doesn't really have a career anymore. And at number eight, Jennifer Grey. Jennifer Grey became a household name after her role on Dirty Dancing. After that movie, she became known for her unique nose, and her agents felt she would expand her career and become more marketable by shrinking it with surgery. But sadly, it was the exact opposite. After she got a nose job in 1989, her career basically disappeared. In an interview after the surgery, she said, quote, I decided to make fun of this, to make my fiasco become my reality. After all, it's not cancer and it's absurd that just a nose job could wreak such havoc. She told The Mirror years later, quote, I went into the operating room a celebrity and came out anonymous. I'll always be this once famous actress nobody recognizes because of a nose job. And at number seven, Mickey Rourke. Mickey Rourke was a very successful actor, but after multiple botched surgeries, his career took a hit. In the early 90s, Rourke decided to take a break from his acting career and pursue a boxing career. He was a good fighter and won all of his matches, but his face paid the real price. After facial damage from the boxing, he underwent multiple surgeries to look how he had before. However, these botched surgeries temporarily hurt his acting prospects. He told the Daily Mail about the surgeries, quote, most of it was to mend the mess of my face because of the boxing, but I went to the wrong guy to put my face back together, saying that he broke his nose twice and had five surgeries to repair it, along with a smashed cheekbone. After correcting a lot of the surgery, Rourke's career is beginning to pick up once again, but he isn't done going under the knife. In October of 2017, he revealed on Instagram that he underwent yet another nose job to correct prior work, writing, quote, now I am pretty again. And at number six, Adrian Baylon. The real host and former Disney Channel star has opened up about regretting her decision to get breast implants in her teens. She told E! News in 2014, quote, when I was 19 years old, I actually did get breast implants, probably one of my greatest regrets. I went from having an insecure that I didn't have big breasts to now looking like an adult film star. And I was like, uh, this is not great. She also revealed that she got the procedure right before she was set to film Cheetah Girls number two. It was quite a shock for the Disney executives, but she says the implants did not last and she decided to get them taken out shortly after. She also added that it stretched out her skin, adding quote, it was not the smartest decision for my career and just for myself. It was wanting to feel like a woman. But thankfully she was able to fix things and now has a great career hosting The Real. Halfway to number five, Tara Reid. The American Pie star is another celebrity that tried to get work done to make her career better, but sadly it just made it way worse. In 2004, she decided to get a breast augmentation that left her with rippled skin and deformed and body contouring, done by the same surgeon, which changed her stomach area for the worse. In a 2007 interview, she said, quote, My stomach became the most ripply, bulgy thing. I had a hernia, this huge bump next to my belly button. As a result, I couldn't wear a bikini, I lost a lot of work. 
She also regretted the look of the breast augmentation, saying, quote, After six months of it's going to get better, it started to get worse and worse. I never thought I would have a that looked like this. Reed had the procedure reversed in 2006, but her career did not make a comeback. And at number four, Lisa Rinna. Lisa Rinna is famous for her huge lips on The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, and she's even turned her big lips into a lip line. However, it wasn't always smooth sailing, and years back, her lips cost her a lot of big acting roles. In a 2013 interview with The Today Show, Rinna revealed that she had her lips injected with silicone when she was 24. But sadly, after a while, her lips started to look very unnatural, and they became hard and gross. After her lips looked too unnatural to put on the big screen, Rinna started losing out roles. And that's why she's mainly gotten small TV roles for the majority of her career, until she started up with the Real Housewives franchise. She reportedly got so tired of the scrutiny surrounding her mouth that she went under the knife again in 2016 to shrink her upper lip. Quote, my lips started to define who I am, that bothered me. And at number three, Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson will always be remembered as one of the most influential artists of all time. But sadly, towards the end of his life, he was known for a shocking transformation achieved through plastic surgery. It's rumored that he underwent countless nose jobs as well as skin bleaching. However, Jackson claimed to have vitiligo, and that's why his skin lightened over time. When asked about a nose job, Jackson told Martin Bashir, quote, I've had no plastic surgery on my face, just my nose. It helped me breathe better so I can hit higher notes. I've had two nose jobs as I can remember. However, many plastic surgeons speculate he had far more than two nose jobs, and he developed nasal cripples due to the lack of tissue to breathe through. At one point, it was even speculated that Jackson might have a hole in his nose due to a botched procedure that he had to cover with a band-aid in public. And at number two, Cardi B. Cardi B loves making money, and she said in the past that she's only a rapper because she felt it would make her the most money. However, this money train was temporarily put on hold when she had to cancel a few of her tour dates to recover from surgery. She had complications from liposuction and was still in the process of recovering from breast implants, so she wasn't able to perform. She clapped back at critics who called her lazy for getting the lipo instead of working out. And she replied that being an entertainer is a 24-hour job, and she doesn't have time to work out. She added, quote, I hate canceling shows because I love money. I'm a money addict. I get paid a lot of money for these shows. I'm canceling millions of dollars in shows, but health is wealth, so I have to do what I have to do. Apparently, all the traveling was making her body swell and putting her at serious risk of further complications. So she decided to take the break and heal. And finally, at number one, Donatella Versace. Donatella achieved fame through running high-end fashion brand Versace with her late brother, Gianni. But as the years have went by, Donatella has stopped being known for her fashion accolades and rather for her botched surgery that have made her unrecognizable. Most would say it's changed her for the worst. Over time, she's become unrecognizable, with her nose and lips changing the most. It's gotten so bad that Donatella has landed herself on pretty much every worst plastic surgery list there is. Donatella has only admitted to getting Botox, nothing more, and she claims not to regret any of the work that she's done. But since her reputation has taken such a hit because of her changing face, we can assume it's had a negative impact on her career. At the very least, it's made her less respected by the public. Alright guys, that is all for the list today. Let me know your thoughts below and let me know anyone that I missed. It could be in a part two. I've been your host, Mackenzie Smith, and we'll catch you in the next one.